A Testament Against the World The Lord's Rebuke The Lord has turned to the world his back, and not the front. April 25, 2011 From the Lord our God and Savior, for all those who have ears to hear. Thus says the Lord to this accursed generation, You brood of vipers! You nailed him to the tree! And still you crucify your king again and again! Even now you drive in the nails! Even now you refuse to drink the blood, which was poured out to heal you! Accursed generation! You shall die. Verily I say unto you, You shall all surely die, Unless you bow to the Son, Whom you had pierced. Therefore, my servants, Do not cease from telling this dying people What I have done for them, For it shall be for a testament against them. For the Lord their God has turned his face away from them. They shall not see me again until the day they all bow down before me, saying, Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Therefore, all who have protest, depart from me. For the Lord your God is a great king, and his glory shall surely be revealed. With his wrath, poured out upon this wicked, lying, and corrupt generation. For I have looked upon you. I have seen all your reveling, in where you have taken much pleasure in all your lusts, lusts of every kind, and debauchery, walking always in your pride. You shall surely die, declares the Lord. For the Son of Man has spoken it. Lo, I have declared it before the nations. Death shall chase you into the corners. It shall be found among you, and in all the high places shall it come to dwell. For yes, I have spoken it. And I say it once again. I have seen it. Therefore, thus says the Lord. No more shall my name be profaned among you. You are all as dogs before me. Be removed. You are cast down. Be removed from my holy city, all you squawking birds. For your God has surely spit you out. You are a trapped and confined people, captive children. You shall not see my hand giving you bread any more. You are all cut off, and my hand is removed. Hence, you are given up to the fire, and it shall burn you. Yea, it shall assault you seven times. This wicked generation is accursed in my sight. They are deaf. They refuse to listen. Look, behold, they have hated me. They have no love for God in their hearts. Therefore did I send my servants to prophesy to them. Yet they will not listen. They are cut off. I do love them. Yet they refuse to hear my voice. And when I speak to them, they surely reproach the living God. Therefore they shall all, from the least, even unto the greatest, perish, says the Lord. The wicked shall be consumed. In the heat of my indignation they shall all be removed. Yet I shall not make a total end. For I have reserved to myself a remnant, a great harvest among the second. And as gold in a raging fire, so shall these be purified, says the Lord.